Hey, Fiend. Oh, no. Hey, Fiend. What? Guess what? Do I have to? Guess what? <sighs> Against all better judgment, what? We're on the fucking cruise, baby! Let's just get going. <laughs> oh, we've been wanting to play this together for a while. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're we're doing some motherfucking Pirate Warriors four. And we're just like mid through the story. Well, mid through the story. Yeah, right. We don't even know if we're mid through the story currently. So One Piece spoilers. Uh, ahead of time. Oh yeah, we're gonna be heavy we're gonna spoiling. Be yeah. Yeah, we're both caught up on the manga. I'll try to keep talking about Wano too much out of the way just for people that aren't caught up. But uh, yeah, we're, we're huge One Piece fans. It's my favorite anime of all time. Like, I, I have others I like a little bit more over time for nostalgia reasons, but it's up there. Hmm. This is just... I mean, there's, there's others that, like... One Piece is just my favorite overall, because it's I've been with it for so long, and it's had a, such a huge impact on me. And even though it's... There's others that I love, this one's all in all... Um, all in all, just my favorite. I'm over here beating the shit out of Smoker. Really? Me too! Oh, I see you. Hello. I am wearing the wrong costume for this era. <laughs> okay, we're not going to match that. Cool. Alright, so I'm playing as Luffy. Fiend is my second player. He is... Zoro. I'm the most Which is funny because when you play when you play with two players, uh I think I could end up with two Zoros on the map. I'm the most popular character, apparently. <laughs> really? Yeah, Zoro is the most popular character. And I guess I can see that. Zoro is cool as fuck. Like they even did the whole thing where they do the top hundred characters in this magazine every year. Zoro tops the charts nearly every year. <laughs> well, he's cool, and he keeps getting cooler. I mean, I just kind of love that the whole reason he joined the crew is because he was basically kidnapped into it. Not really, he decided on it. Luffy saved him, so he's like, well, I guess I should join you. Even though he started off saying, you know I should be killing you, right? Yeah. But then again, it's kind and, of universally uh, agreed Luffy is an overall dumbass. Oh yeah. And even Luffy knows that. Yeah, it's like, Luffy is one of the more, as weird to say, down-to-earth characters to where it's like, he is a dumbass, he is reckless, but my god does he care. Mm hmm And Zoro is probably Luffy's most loyal uh, crewmate. Which is, again, very ironic. Yeah, I mean, because of how it's, like, how Zoro is introduced, but... Yeah, Zoro is the one that's been the most, like, down to, like... Ever, like, he's never faltered. And he's also kept Luffy's head on straight more often than not. Wow! I feel there have definitely been better characters that do that. Maybe, but... Half the time he encourages Zoro. it. Well, yeah, it depends. But, like, Zoro's the one that, like, when the Usopp shit happens... Which we might Zoro's get to, because like, I think that is in this game. It is. Um, and that's when Zoro we get to see is, my favorite crewmate. Zoro is the one that's like, Luffy's a captain. He has to... Tr like, we might be friends, but first and foremost, he's our captain. And you go against the captain, you go against the crew. I will say, like, I... spoilers, again, we're gonna be heavy spoiling this. Obviously, this is not the first arc in the whole show. It's kind of weird that they kind of start, like, really into it. 
Well, they start here because this is Pirate Warriors 4, and they've already gone through all that other shit so many times. But all that stuff is still big! Point. Yeah, it is, but they wanted to get further into the story. Because, I mean, yeah. Without having to just water down the other chapters. Because, I mean, yeah, there are certain parts that, yeah, make sense that they skip. Because, I mean. Bean? Bean, if you want to play the old stuff, play the old games. I mean. That's all I'm saying about it. That's all I'm saying about it. That's all that matters. They do a recap, that's fine. But if you really want to play through the, the first stories, pick up Pirate Warriors 1. Do they do a recap? I mean, do Pirate Warriors 3. They start at the beginning. Pirate Warriors 3 is real good. Yes. Where am I at? What's our, we're still just... Defeat Marines. Yeah, we're still... Yeah, I noticed that Nami and Usopp were about to die, so I went over to save them. Yeah, I'm just fighting things and talking. Oh goody! Really it's my rival! Second Zoro! Did you find Zoro too? Yeah! Uh, <laughs> those are the days when I was younger. And I had both of my eyes. Yeah, we still haven't found out exactly how he lost his eye. I personally think it was a cat. They recently mentioned something too about uh another oh ryuga uh so more more spoilers <laughs> I, I mean we're just we're just gonna say right here we're gonna be yeah. spoiling a lot yeah. they recently talked about ryuga and how like and how like zoro brought back back his sword to wano uh and how Ryuga was also a really great one-eyed swordsman. Oh, you're talking about the recent chapter. Uh-huh. Like, I was trying to remember who the hell Ryuga was, but now yeah, Ryuga, I remember. Yeah, Ryuga was the samurai from, uh... Which we also might get to Bark. see later. I think we see a little bit of Thriller Bark, yeah. It's kind of interesting. We talk about the arc that my favorite character is introduced, and now we're talking about the arc your favorite character is introduced. <laughs> yeah, my second favorite character is introduced. I thought he was your favorite. Nope. Oh yeah, my yeah, yeah. Favorite. I know who you're talking about. That's when we get yeah. to jail. Nope, before that, you, you you meet him before that. Really? You meet him. Oh, you're uh, talking yeah, about. You oh, you're talking about him. I thought you were talking about uh, the one you do meet in jail. No, yeah, I'm talking about fucking law. Like, oh, law. Oh, oh. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about Ivankov. No, Ivankov is third favorite. And then after that, I thought you were talking about Mr. Three. Fuck that. Mr. Two is my favorite. Oh, Mr. Er, Two. Uh, I always get yeah. them confused. Of the of them, anyway. Von Clay. Yeah. AKA, I feel they did not know which voice actor they were going to cast at that point. <laughs> and, uh... I don't... Oh, God. What's his English voice? I actually just recently, like, was watching through that, and I don't remember, but I just remember it was actually really good. They do really good in the English version of One Piece. See, that's what I thought, too. It's like, this is something you could definitely watch either subbed or dubbed. And I had to do yeah. both, because I grinded through the whole series. Yeah, and dubbed is real good. Yeah, and it's why I'm like, there are certain voices I hear way better in English than I do in Japan. Like yeah. Frankie's. Frankie's voice is really hard to separate from the English. But Frankie, Frankie has to shit. Wrong game. Oh wait. <laughs> but it's the same guy. I mean, it is. But in that instance, then he would also be a member of the Spider Clan. <laughs> I love, I love that. I can no longer, I can no longer think about uh, Frankie in English without thinking about Danganronpa. Which is 
slightly think, depressing, but I'll let it slide. And <laughs> think about Frankie just screaming, I have to shit! <laughs> Which doesn't even make sense with his character. I think. I, I don't know what parts of him are and aren't, so... <laughs> well, actually, I think it's a lot, actually, now. Yeah, no, Frankie is like, oh my god, Frankie is the character with the most transformation. Plus, I love Frankie a lot. He's basically the dad of the crew. Something like that. Yeah. Like, he's the most adult. Well, most adult of the males. Yeah, I was gonna say, Robin's the, like... She's, she's the mom she's, of the crew. She's the mom. And... People... And people have a right to say that Robin... Robin doesn't do a whole lot in a lot of the series. But, uh... In ways, they're not wrong. Recent... Recent chapter of Wano, man. Oh, yeah. Although, I will say, maybe we shouldn't have had to wait until getting that far. Yeah. Oh my god. I don't want to... God damn it. Recent cha a recent chapter of uh, Wano for Nami. Nami fucking, like, shows her loyalty. Oh god, yeah. She, it was, like, real good. I'm just like, holy shit, Nami, you... You would have done the complete opposite thing forever ago. And she did. It was literally like... I'm trying not to give too much away about Wano stuff, but she goes through another situation, a very similar situation to something that she's been through before. And, and uh, you know, she... She makes a decision purely as like a... God, I have to survive. Like, I, I need to survive or else I'll never see my friends again. Like, this is the only way I'll see my friends. Also, can I just and say, we've been talking about all of these current arcs and everything. We haven't said anything about Alabasta so far. Yeah. I mean... True. I mean, up to, <laughs> up to this point, who would you say would be probably your favorite character of the bunch? Which bunch? The current bunch. Oh, uh, at this point, my favorite was Sanji. Really? Yeah. Ninja. Sanji was my favorite. Probably well, my favorite of the Straw Hats. Probably up to Thriller Bark. Really? For multiple, for multiple reasons. <clears throat> One, because Sanji just really started to show his creepiness in Thriller Bark. Yeah, Thriller uh, Bark was uh, not his best. And, and in Thriller Bark, we got a much funnier pervert. <laughs> and, like, it's weird because Sanji is such a perv in that arc, it's almost uncharacteristic. But it's, it's like, way worse, though, than ever. It's like, they took that fucking gag too far in Thriller Bark, and oh, yeah. I did not, I like, after Thriller Bark, my love for Sanji started to dwindle until Whole Cake Island. Yeah, cause uh, Fishman Island didn't help him out either. Nope. And then, you know, he wasn't really in Dressrosa. Yeah. <laughs> that we literally had like two years of two or three years in real life of manga um, comics where we did not see half the crew, including Sanji. Yeah, I think out of this bunch, Usopp was probably my favorite. Like, uh, Usopp was okay, but he wasn't my favorite yet. He, oh, he wasn't one of my favorites yet. Usopp was such a character. That it's like, the more he grew, the more he stayed the same. Yeah. Usopp? 
Usapike like, is one of the characters with the most growth. And Usopp started to grow on like Usopp started to grow in my on my like rankings of characters. Again in Thriller Bark. Oh, yeah, I know exactly what part of Thriller Bark you're talking about. Yeah, where he fights another one of my favorite characters. <laughs> and I think the thing I like about Usopp is he's able to get a win in the most unusual yet creative of ways. Oh, yeah. And he gets his ass kicked. Yup. And uh, I think that's what makes him endearing. He, he seems like the... He seems like the least likely to win in a fight. And, and yet, he's almost and then like he always, a god. He always pulls it off. He even gets people out of fucking situations. And yet, when you, when you first get him in the crew and everything... Like, I'm not gonna lie, his introduction wasn't the best. It was just sort of there. Yeah. But it did give us the going Mary, so... I guess it's something. Yeah, like it, it really set up his character really well. And what's really interesting is a lot of the fake stories that he used to tell to Kaya have in ways come true. Yeah. <laughs> oh, do you have to invite <laughs> like, me to this too? I don't know. I'm in the results screen. Oh. But I, I might have to invite you. Um... Game mode pretty well can help be played. Well, you know what? Let's uh, let's do the next level on the next episode. I'll go. Th I'll let the um, cinematic play here first, though. All right. Little army has moved the race to a town near the capital. I really hope before the series ends that VV makes a comeback. I mean, they're heavily hinting at it. Oh yeah, they do a lot. I want, I want VV. I want fucking Carrot to join, and I want. Well, I think we know who the last crewmate is going to be, just by literally them blurting out how they're going to join. Who? I'm. I'm. I'm, I'm like, I'm blanking on that one. Other than VV, maybe. You know, the one guy's son. Oh, I hope not. They've been I mean, blurting out straight up how they want to have the adventure the other person had. Yeah, true. I mean, it'd be a very sudden joining, but, I mean, let's be honest. There was already a sudden joining. Yeah. Wano has one of the, like, one of my favorite absolute favorite uh one of my absolute favorite people joining officially joining the straw hat crew oh hell yeah that one i'm going to try not to spoil yet we'll, just... we'll get there i remember the way when it happened i like squealing and then he went to the background I think I sent it to you. I like. I think I like was like being. I have to spoil this for you. Oh yeah, and I and I did. And then you're like, I have to catch up on One Piece. <laughs> well, yeah, because that guy was one of my favorite characters. Oh man. But yeah, I'd like to see BB uh, join, and I'd like to see. I'd also really like to see Carrot join. <laughs> I, I I don't know. I still think it's gonna be him that, or them that joins. I think. I think. What? I think the Straw Hats are gonna have at least ten people by the end. Well, yeah. He mentions how many crewmates he wants to have. Yeah. So he has room for one more. He also has an army. <laughs> Multiple armies. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, he could easily just have, like, he could, once, once he becomes king of the pirates, he could easily just... He has an army, and he doesn't even want it. Yeah! No, they're just like, no. <laughs> like, we're your friends now. We're your army. Deal with it. <laughs> oh, they don't say friends. Okay. They don't say friends. <laughs> 
That said, the man in charge of that <laughs> army is one of my favorite characters of the whole thing. <laughs> Tell me where to find Crocodile! Man, I I will say, one thing I kind of wish they- I wish we could have at least started when they recruit Nami, because her arc is probably one of the best starting. Then play Pi- then play Pirate Warriors 1. 3. Or 3. Either one. Like, just do 3, because that has everything up to that point. Yep. All right. Uh, we'll call this episode, and we will see y'all in the next chapter. Uh, I will say too, for anybody that's stuck by, uh, for one, thank you, and two, episodes might be a little slow going. Uh, might miss some days, things in there. I'm moving. Fiend's moving. Yo. Uh, I might be starting a job soon. I don't know. I've got an interview this week. We'll see I'm what happens. Some wisdom teeth pulled, so that'll put me out of action. Yeah, but uh, you know, we'll release when we can. Uh, stick around, keep watching if you can. Support us, subscribe, tell all your friends. We need. But anyway, uh, yeah, just just wanted to throw that out there. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next chapter of Alabasta. Later. Bye.